What is up guys? I know you can't see me very well. I apologize. I actually just left the gym. I wasn't planning on vlogging today. I usually vlog every other day uh, trying to you know keep up with editing and all that fun stuff. Anyway, that aside, so today I wasn't planning on vlogging. That's why there's no gym work. But something did actually come up and I felt like I, I, I wanted to vlog it. I thought it'd be fun to vlog. So here's the thing. The thing is, is whenever we moved out of our house, and I, this is going to sound horrible, but it just, just listen to me a little bit. So whenever we moved out of our other house, um, we, I, we left a cat behind. So Jingles, you might have seen him in one of my Instagram. We loved him. We, did, we didn't, we didn't want to leave him behind, but he started going outside and he didn't come back and we couldn't find him. So the family was heartbroken. We don't know what happened to him. We don't know if he's alive, if he's dead. We, don't, we have no idea. And it was sad and everybody was sad, but the, most pers the person that was mostly upset about it was my daughter. She loved Jingles and she loves she loves cats. She's a cat person. We got Joe. She loves Joe, but she really loves cats. She likes cats. So what I'm getting at is they were up and they were taking Joe to uh, to the vet today to get his his checkup and all that fun stuff that you have to do with your pets and all that. But she's seen a cat and we promised her whenever we moved out of there, you know, we're like, okay, we know you want a cat, we know you miss Jingles. We know that a cat won't replace Jingles if we get you another one. She understood all that, but she really wanted another cat, another, you know, cat to bond with. And that we completely understand that. So we want to get her another cat. While they were up there, we actually took, uh, we, she seen a cat. And I'll go ahead and flash the picture up here on the, on the screen real quick. It was the cutest thing. She actually, you know, put her hand to the, the glass and the cat like touched her hand. So... You know, normally I'm just like, no, you can't just go into a store, pick up the first cat, and then just, you know, have a cat. That's not how it works. You have to go and you have to bond with one. You have, you know, all this. And, you know, whenever you go pick out a pet, that's what you usually want to do. You want to make sure that the kid's not getting a pet just because, for the pet's sake, just to have a pet. But, you know, the cat, it touched, it touched your hand. And they might have done that anyway because, you know, cats like playing around and touching your hand while it touches the glass and all that fun stuff. Anyway, it was the cutest thing ever and she actually just started crying. She wanted this cat named Macy so bad. So I left the gym early. I cut out two of my exercises, left the gym early to actually go up to this place because Megan didn't have the correct card with her to actually purchase this cat. So we're getting the cat from PetSmart. Um, I know there's some people that might might disagree with that, and I understand that, but the cat still needs rescued. So we're getting the cat from PetSmart. She's $150 for the, uh, the adoption fee. Um, she's already fixed and all that fun stuff for shots and everything up to date. She's already housebroken. She's only like eight weeks old, so she's still a baby. So I guess what I'm trying to say, guys, is we're bringing home a new family member tonight. Um, so I'm going to vlog again whenever I get to the store and show you guys Macy and we'll vlog whenever we get her home and let you guys know what all's going on with Macy and how hopefully excited Adeline is because the little girl's spoiled, I'll tell you right now. We're gonna put her in a cage so she doesn't run away. Well, we're gonna have to find her a cat carrier or we'll have to take her home in a box carrier. A box? Yeah. A box? How do we get a box carrier? Oh, we put it in a I don't see times on her. You think I hold you? Hey, she might grow up big. And she is not a shitty yet. You can take care of. Oh, you can spade it. Yep. Got the hand. She's got her rabies shots. We tested for everything. Okay. Uh, here's her. Daddy, have you felt her? So what she saw? You gotta do is just give her a bunch of love. Alright, you get that? Sure, she'll be fine with that. Oh, I love kitties too much. I hug them tight as I can. Oh, don't do that. Well, I don't like them tight like. This. Can you Oh. Think she's going home? Careful. <laughs> this is how you hold kids. Is that how you hold? She's going to get used to Adeline real quick, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. She's going to have to. <laughs> you love her name, Macy? That's a really cute name. Careful. She don't squeeze her too tight. Oh, it's crazy. See how mommy's holding her? 
I That's how you're supposed to hold it. I'm gonna have to teach you some tricks and stuff. Oh, there's just putting it on your back. There you go. Just like that. Okay, okay, try again. Okay, pick her up again. I think I got it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's Hey, wait. What's her name again? Macy. Macy! 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 She's like, I don't think so. I'm playing. Alright, so we finally made it home tonight. So it's like 8 o'clock now. 8.40, it's almost 9 o'clock. So we are fixing to let Macy out for the first time at the house. Adeline's super excited. So you want to let her out? You ready? Push the top. You gotta push the top one down. Push it down. If she's new to this area, let her walk around a little bit. <laughs> you like it? I'm going to go show you my No, room. no. I, let her walk around a little bit. Let her find out where things are. I wonder if she knows how to climb stairs. I'm yes. sure she'll be able to climb stairs. Megan over here got the litter box ready because she's a trooper. She'll be the one cleaning that out. No? No? All right, I guess that's like a shared duty. Duty. I would say yeah. Yeah, you think so? I don't know. I think should be Evans. Wait, take the top off, Kim. Uh, top? Yeah, off that. Litter in here. Anyway, we're going to get this all situated and we help Megan put this together, put the litter box together, put everything all together, feed the cat, and then we're going to feed ourselves real quick. I'll show you guys what we got for dinner. When are we actually get to eat it? Can anybody guess where the cat is? <laughs> Mommy to the rescue! Okay, let's close that door. <laughs> Maybe he's gonna show her where her little box is real quick. Make sure she gets in. She's like, no, 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 no. She's like, I'm not gonna go there. She's like, she's like, no. Joe, this is not for you. <laughs> well, Joe, use it. Let him use it. <laughs> what? What? Yeah, I'm excited. He's jealous. He's already jealous. Look at him. He's like, I got a friend. I got a friend to stay here with me. I got a friend to stay with me during the day. I'm so excited. We are now sitting down to eat finally. I think it's like a little after nine. So this is what I'm having. Got some two chicken sandwiches here, spicy chicken, some uh, chili. Got some french fries. Those are actually Cameron's. I'm eating anyway. Cause it's good. There you are. May has got a crispy chicken as well, I think, right? Uh -uh. Spicy chicken? No, what do you got? Grilled chicken. Grilled chicken? Look at her being good. Some chili as well, some chicken nuggets. 
That's pretty much about it, guys. So that's going to be the end of our night. Macy's running around the house. Actually, she's hidden somewhere right now. I think she'll get better once we leave her alone a little bit. Adeline's probably got a little, little stress out at the moment. But we're going to watch some Full House. Fuller House. And that's going to be the end of our night. So make sure to like the video if you like the video. Comment down below and subscribe. Teach Stone. Thank you.